you can examine your blood packs to determine their types. Okay. But like, here's the thing. Door is locked. Would you like to unlock it? You can only try it once, but it won't break the lock. So if you find the key, you can still open it. Wait a minute. You can open a lock with a key. Anyway. Never mind. So there you go. There's a key somewhere anyway. It's probably on that bright guy. Either he actually has it on him or he'll give it to us when we do what he asks. So we're going to go to the basement. That hurt more than it should have. Basement, basement. Basement. Where's the basement? And if I don't find it just sprinting around like this, which I probably won't, I can look at my map after I've pretty much uncovered everything. I use my map to tell me where it is. Uh, little map. Ah, voila. Dude. What the hell? I can't get through Basement door is either below me, above me, or below me. Don't jump. Eh, is there a staircase like right by me, or do I need to jump to do it quickly? Ah, there it is. Yeah. Staircases, staircases everywhere, but not a one of them goes down. <laughs> and it's a bathroom. That's the staircase that goes up. What the hell? All the staircases go up. Maybe the basement door is even higher up? I don't even know. There could be a reason I can't get to it. Maybe there's like a hole I can jump down. There it is. Dark in here. So I need to strike a spot for you. Keep you on target. Take all the kills. Aha. Uh -huh. See? And why does it take half my AP? Um, why is it not letting me... There we go. Dude! They move fast. I have bullet time. Run from me. See that? All those bullets, and I barely dented his health. Two bullets from Boone killed his ass.
Sometimes I wonder why I bother carrying a gun. Wish I had a cat eye. Yes, indeed I do. Wish I had a cat eye. You know, I'm not seeing as many forks as I remember there being in this game. I guess when you're actively looking for them, it just seems like they're less common. compass point so I guess I'm just have to walk around. Shoot anything I see. Further down. By the way, this is the part where I had the first time I played I had to come back to So without boom, even now I kind of have problems here. It's just that boom is so damn good. a key, a bunch of bodies I didn't search. Hell, a whole building I didn't really search. I mean, I glances around everything and I picked up a couple fission batteries, but that's it. Well, it was the key to that door on one of the things I already killed. That's a stupid question. It's almost certainly, yeah. Pilot lights? Why are pilot lights lying around out here? Well, that one didn't have anything important. That one had a jail key. Is that the right key? I don't think it is. There's only one way to be certain. Where's that stupid door at? <laughs> yep, that's it. Awesome. I only had to check two bodies to find it. There's nothing here. What's the dealio? Yo. I and mean, there's no loot of any kind. There's one dead rule. That's it. One dead ghoul. That's just a waste of time, man. So what exactly is my quest? Get rid of the night can in the basement. So I just got to make sure I explore the whole damn basement. Except for, I'm pretty sure I have explored this whole portion of the basement. 
said that word weird. Word weird. You guys remember Angry Beavers? That was a great show. Like, the best part of the whole damn thing was the fact that in every episode, pretty much every word was mispronounced. And they did it on purpose. And then every once in a while they would correct each other. And sometimes they'd correct it to the right pronunciation, sometimes they'd correct it to the wrong pronunciation. And in most cases, in the middle of correcting it, they'd say another ridiculously wrong word. Yeah, there's a retcon facility thing. And I'm not seeing anything else. I mean, this whole room was virtually pointless. I'm not seeing anywhere else to go up here. And this is that room now that I think about it. Well, actually, I see a hallway. I think. These maps are really hard to use. But I think I see a hallway down this way. Indeed I do. Victory is mine. Come and get it, you big dumb. Hey, you're not one of those things out there. Who the hell are you? And I bet he told you it's the creator's will for you to risk your ass instead of him, right? More or less. Well, good luck with that. I'd give you a hand. But no thanks. I may look like a corpse, but I'm partial to living. First off, I'm not trapped. This was a tactical choice, alright? I'm no match for those things out there. So I found a good defensive position, and I've been defending it, right? Oh, who am I fooling? I'm trapped. Name's Harlan. Pleased to meet you. What happened was... I was escorting folks down to work when those things attacked us. Most of the fight was upstairs, but some folks panicked and made for the basement, and I went after them. Well, turns out there were even more of those bastards down here than upstairs, and things went to shit fast. I couldn't find the others, so I fell back to this room and set up a nice little kill zone. End of story. Guess the outfit gives that away, huh? I never did buy into that religious mumbo jumbo with the robes and all that shit. It gets lonely out in the wastes, okay? And I don't have to tell you that Bright's group has got some fine looking goulettes in it. Huh. Or maybe I would have to tell you. Anyway, <laughs> I helped them out, and they kept me supplied with ammo and pleasant company. I'm not delicate. Rad roach meat for protein, condensation off the pipes for water, and I do my business over in the far corner. I wouldn't say it's been comfy. Huh. Well, you're polite. I'll give you that. If this was just between you and me, I'd do as you ask. But it's not. I had a friend with me when those mutant bastards came out of nowhere. She panicked and ran the wrong direction. Further into the basement. She's probably dead. But I ain't leaving until I know for sure. I'd have gone looking myself. Except I wouldn't last a minute out there. We already found her. You, on the other hand, seem pretty resourceful. Find my friend, and I'll get out of your way. I see. Spare me the details. God damn. She had the yellowest smile. You did your part, so I'll do mine. Go ahead and move around up here if you want. I'm going to make a break for topside. Have fun with that. 